Good morning, everybody, and welcome back. We haven't done a full day of eating vlog in a long time, and I really, really wanted to get one in while I'm on these calories. Um, so, yeah, I realise a lot of you aren't going to be eating this much, but I just wanted to give an insight into what foods I eat, what meals I kind of go for when my calories are this high. Um, so I'm on like three and a half thousand calories at the moment. Highest I have ever been. So this is like peak, peak, peak bulk off season uh, calories and they won't be back up here for a very long time because prep starts in November. So yeah, I just wanted to, to do a fun one. Um, starting off my day with a brekkie, of course, and I'm just having some OJ, fresh OJ, with bits, with bits. Um, and that is going to help me get some carbs in early in the morning. Liquid carbs aren't going to make me feel very full. Um, and they're also great to get in pre-gym. So this is like my breakfast, but my pre-workout meal as well, because I train in the morning. Um, then I'm going to have some bagels. I'm going to have turkey bacon, one egg, and then this, oh my God, tastes like the normal Philadelphia. There's no fat in it. It's amazing. Great base for sauces. I'm going to show you that later. Okay, so all of the bits are cooked. Oh no. Why does that always happen when you put on a white top? Just like an unwritten reel, right? Um. Anyway, so having... 30 grams of this spread and like it's just such low calories it's so great um because i really like cream cheese and uh it's not the most calorie friendly and then having this um just lets me have a spread of some sort like because it helps me keep my fats low i'm not like you know reaching for butter all the time um and i enjoy it so that's the main thing, right? Uh, so there's actually a lot more bacon there than I thought. I just wanted to finish the packet. It's 150 grams of the uh, lean turkey bacon. And I really like this because it's like actual meat rather than um, very like processed streaky kind of bacon. Um, that would just be my preference. And that's the one from Dublin Eco itself. Really like it. Um, and then I have my coffee, of course. And after this, I'm going to just sit down for a little while, do some client work. I have some workout reviews to do um, and then get to the gym ASAP because I actually have my pre... Oh, no. Oh, my God. I'm a day ahead of myself. <laughs> I thought it was Wednesday, guys. Um, OK, so it's loads of work, basically, today. And uh, gym. I have a pus... <laughs> a push session and um then I actually need to go down to the hospital and get my foot looked at because it is still sore and if anyone doesn't know the story basically I fell out of a bus a few weeks ago <laughs> yeah mm-hmm mm-hmm so here's how we're looking now I never have runny eggs okay but I said you know for YouTube I'll oh, break my bagels upside down too god Oh, look at this. Oh my God. It actually doesn't even squash, guys. <laughs> Fail, but very cool. Fucker. <laughs> anyway, here's my <laughs> breakfast bagel. So it is snack time, pre-gym, and I have some of this. Um, I just love Breck. It's <laughs> such a good Halloween treat. And it will be gone uh, once I get back to Australia and start prep. So I'm just allowing myself some slices of that this week. And I just have that with some light spread to save on fats. Um, good hit of carbs and kind of sugar and stuff pre-workout. So good time of the day to have. So here we have my Breck. Now, look, don't want to get ahead of myself, but this is the second time in a week that I've got the ring out of the Breck. So... Clearly, Gary is just trying to cheap out <laughs> my days on me. And we are back from the gym um, and I'm about to have my post-workout meal, which is two Domenico turkey burgers. They got a new flavour, garlic and herb or something. something. And then I have uh, 275 grams of boiled potatoes, 
I went to make my broccoli and realized I was all out. So I have no vegetables in this meal. Uh, I'm a fraud. I also have some um, chicken gravy to go in the spuds because I don't have fats for butter today. <laughs> I give me a look. There are some good fluffy Irish spuds. And we have turkey burgers, and we have datos, and we have gravy. Get that into you. Now, honestly, I love basic food like this. I just, it's such comfort food, especially when it's cold. Let's be real, I eat it in the height of summer as well. But this is today's post-workout meal. Protein, carbs, zero fat. And we are on the road. We're not in the road. Right now, we are parked, we are parked, we're not moving. Um, and I'm just gonna show you the car snacks I brought with me. So stopped to get a little coffee. It's still only half two, so I'm allowing myself that. And these guys, I swear to God, I sent my mom up to Newry on Saturday and she got me like a crate of them to bring back. Where I'm gonna fit them, I don't know, but you can't get them in Australia, they're amazing. The 62 calories, so I'm having five. Um, and they're just class. They're just the right amount of sweet to hit a craving or whatever without being like mad sugary, very low fat. Like it's just, it's rice cakes with like little chocolate chips on it. Um, so it's not the coated ones. Um, and yeah, they're delicious. And my coffee order is a small oat milk cappuccino, strong and frothy. And we are back. Take two of the caramels today. Real bodybuilder style. The lunchbox is with me, and we have uh, the turkey chili jalapeno sausages from Dublamico. Oh my god, they are so good! If you are shopping there, you can use my code DMC Boss Ten gets you ten percent off your online orders. Every little helps, um, and they are very nice. I don't actually eat them on their own anymore. I prefer making them into this pasta dish. Um, I do have a recipe on my Instagram, so go check that out and try it. It's delish. Um, using like Philadelphia Light as the sauce and all that jazz. Very yummy. And um, so I'm gonna have that. It has 100 grams of pasta. So it's a pretty high carb meal of raw pasta. Um, <laughs> so, and your bikini girls are like, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, and then I have two of the sausages, Philadelphia Light and some broccoli for greens. Um, and I just pulled in to get a Coke Zero as well. Oh yes. If you are not on the crumpet buzz yet, you need to be. It's pretty much all carbs, zero fat, a little bit of protein. They are so, so good when you are trying to get more carbs into your diet. Um, I know that is something a lot of ladies I work with struggle initially when, you know, they're not used to eating that kind of high amount of carbs so they are a very good tool to have in your tool box then i also have some banana for extra carbs and then i fit some of this proteinella in Um, i saved some of my fats for this so this you get in little and it's basically just nutella but none of the shite in it um, and it's delicious so i'm gonna toast these crumpets gonna have three 60 grams of bananas 24 grams of this so we are back home. I've just packed my cases for going back to Australia. Oh my God, I'm so gonna have to take some stuff out. Oh my God, it's so hard. I've already booked an extra case. Mm. Anyway, I am gonna have my snack um, and it is toasted crumpets. This meal is so yummy. Um, I'll run you through it now. And here we have our PM snack. Now, little tip, when you are weighing anything like this, spreads, everything like that, sauces, always make sure it's on the weighing scales, zeroed. And weigh what you take out, not what you put onto something because all those little licks of the spoon add up. And here we have delish. Crumpets, healthy Nutella and banana. And we are back in the kitchen. <laughs> um, I'm just about to make my last meal, which is more or less always the same. It is the, the well, tonight I'm having the white chalk, coconut, uh, cream of rice, trained by JP. That is definitely in my top two. The other one is the complete strength chalk brainy. Um, delish. I'm going to have that with the trained by JP. Um, white chalk raspberry 
way. Very nice combo. Very, very nice. We've no raspberries left, so I'm having frozen blueberries. And then I'm also having my nighttime vitamins. I'll run you through those. So I have my um, soluble vitamin C. I have a B vitamin, B complex, um, iron, D vitamin, fish oils and krill oils. That is my nighttime snack or stack, should I say. Um, and I'm just going to get this prepped. So this is tonight's cream of rice ball. Uh, it's delicious. This combo is really, really nice. That is the exact consistency you want for this. Very good attempt. So guys, that is that for um, the full day of eating. Hope you've enjoyed uh, getting a little insight into how I fit this much food. Um, any questions, drop a comment below. I will also leave all of my links. Um, you can download my free meal planning, guys. That's an idea. Um, I'll leave the link down here. And you can check out my socials for the recipes. 100% try that pasta recipe. And of course, if you would like to chat about online coaching, I will leave the information and links down below as well. And I will see you in the next video.